Two allies of suspended Lord Mayor Lisa Scafidis have been booted off the Perth City Council in WA's local government elections. A record number of former state MPs were up for election, including in Joondalup, where the contest turned bitter. One of the most high-profile mayoral races in recent times. Two former Liberal ministers, Albert Jacob and Rob Johnson, in a hostile contest to become Joondalup mayor. Jacob the victor, the winning margin less than 2%. It was unfortunate that I had to face such a negative, dirty and dishonest campaign uh, from, Ron, from Rob Johnson. Uh, but I'm just so thankful for the community to see through that and to place their trust in me. Nine former MPs were in the running to represent their local councils, but voters only gave three the thumbs up. In Perth, the community put its support behind Steve Hasluck, Rhys Harley, James Limnios and Lexi Barton, giving Lisa Scafidi supporters Keith Young and Judy McAvoy the boot, as well as the former parliamentary speaker Michael Sutherland. I think what the people of the City of Perth have done is send a very strong message uh, that uh, the behaviour at the City of Perth has not been acceptable uh, and I certainly hope uh, that uh, the people, all the councillors on the City of Perth understand that message. In Fremantle, Brad Pettit's controversial decision to cancel Australia Day didn't cost him the top job, narrowly out edging Caroline Stewart to lock in another term as mayor. There's a lot happening in Frio so I was really keen to see it through to be honest with you and um, so this gives us a great opportunity over the next four years to land a few of those big projects we've been talking about. This year saw a record number of candidates, 1,150 statewide, up more than 10% on 2015. Voter numbers also on the rise. Last elections the turnout was about 28% or just under. Uh, this time around we're pushing up towards 35%. Nathan Brooks, Nine News.